University of South Carolina President James Holderman strolled outdoors Monday after a full day of testifying in the lawsuit trial between the university and former athletic director Bob Markham. Markham is suing the university over contract disputes of his March of 1988 firing. Markham was fired for allegedly mishandling the drug testing program. Markham is hoping to collect close to a half a million dollars, which he says he would have collected in wages. Describing himself as a victim of deception, University President James Holderman testified he was led to believe the lifestyle program was working and was shocked at the results of the task force, which showed the program was inadequate. Holderman also testified that Markham gave him a letter two weeks before being fired, requesting that his contract be extended another year, and that Markham was hoping for an increase to his $88,000 a year salary. Markham is also suing the university, saying he was promised a tenure position. However, Holderman testified that giving Markham a tenure position was an unacceptable solution to continued contract extensions. Holderman is expected to resume his place in the witness box when the trial continues Tuesday. From the federal courthouse, John Bernelli, News 19.